Don't let the balloon hit the ground. A childhood favorite. The rules are simple. First, you must hit in order. Next, when it is your turn, if you do not make contact with the balloon before it hits the ground, you are eliminated. Lastly, no scum hits. You can't spike the balloon. If you spike it once, that's a warning. If you spike it twice, that's an automatic elimination. This is an elimination style game with only one winner. Let's get into it. My name is Tom. I am a pro. I am very passionate. I will win this. And not only that, I will eliminate everybody single-handedly. Hi, Joe. Obviously, I'm going to win this because balloons, latex. I'm a professional when it comes to latex items, <laughs> if you know what I mean. That's it? <laughs> <laughs> My name is Logan. And I'm gonna win this challenge because I always won whenever I was a kid, dude. I played this since I was a youth, and I never stopped, and I never will. My name is TJ Hall, and my mission is to get Frank out. Frank started complaining. Why am I not surprised? Look, Frank complaining. What else is new? You know what? The dude's been complaining since birth. You know, his mom gave him formula. He wouldn't stop complaining because he wanted that tata -ta stuff. The dude just doesn't stop. He was born that way. He's gonna always be that way. So you know how I said I was going to eliminate everybody in the game? <laughs> I eliminated myself a little bit too early. On. They all started crying because they didn't want their little piggies to get hurt. And then you got guys not even having socks on, but then and I'm out here slipping and sliding, and breaking ankles and everything. Not other people's, but my own. Socks need to be included. Heck, put your dang shoes on. I don't care. Look, boys, hear me out. If you don't have socks on, you're cheating. If you have these on your feet, first off, it makes it more fun. Second off, that's regulation. Socks are regulation. So if you don't have one, you're cheating. We have two cheaters here. Both of them are in the finals. Coincidence? I think not. It's the first game, dude. I'm in the final two, and they're out here complaining about no socks or something like that, but like, I don't even know what they're talking about. It's not even that big of a deal. <laughs> I don't need no socks to get to the final. What's good? <laughs> Ready? 
<laughs> I have absolutely no idea what's going on. Spiked it, but I don't care because Frank's out, so. So the first game, Frank got eliminated in the first round, and he complained, but I thought, you know what, Tommy's a scumbag, so maybe it actually was Tommy's. But in the second game, he got eliminated again, and he was still complaining, so I, it was kind of hard to think maybe it was Tommy's fault again. I mean, I'm not putting it past him. Once again, Tommy is a scumbag. I don't really care who wins, as long as Frank's not in it. Ended two people. First, he ended Frank, then TJ, and now he's hitting the balloon to me. And I gotta be real with you, I'm a little bit nervous. I kind of want to keep my win streak going. He's on a tear. Yeah, Tommy's on an elimination streak, but I, he got me out second, but he got Frank out first, so that's all I care about. Your boy's on a hot streak. Logan's next on the chopping block. Bleeding all over everything. Uh, enough said. I went crazy out there. Joe! <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. Joe's only kidding, dude. We're best buds. Like, he's my roommate. Like, he would never actually want me to die or anything like that. Like, it's just a game. I'm sure 
<laughs> I'm sure you. I want him dead. I don't know why Fool was laughing that whole time, but like when I tell somebody I want them to die, I want them to die. So, screw off. What I miss?